But since we are here tonight among family and friends, I also want us to be honest with ourselves as Democrats. We might be headed for another one of those long primary fights that lasts for months. We're two states in with 55 states and territories to go. We still have 98% of our delegates for our nomination up for grabs, and Americans in every part of the country are gonna make their voices heard. That's right. The question for us Democrats is whether it will be a long, bitter rehash of the same old divides in our party or whether we can find another way. Senator Sanders and Mayor Buttigieg are both great people and either one of them would be a far better president than Donald Trump. I respect them both. But the fight between factions in our party has taken a sharp turn in recent weeks with ads mocking other candidates and with supporters of some candidates shouting curses at other Democratic candidates. These harsh tactics might work if you are willing to burn down the rest of the party in order to be the last man standing. They might work if you don't worry about leaving our party and our politics worse off than how you found it. And they might work if you think only you have all the answers and only you are the solution to all our problems. But if we're gonna beat Donald Trump in November, we are gonna need huge turnout within our party. And to get that turnout, we will need a nominee that the broadest coalition of our party feels like they can get behind.